there, this is Christian. And we're looking at a pond right now that's 3,500 gallons. And as you can see, we've got it nice and green. This pond was originally clear for about 45 days, but I added a lot of spirulina powder to get the water to green up. I want you to see just how green the water is. You can see the green actually falling back out of the pipe there. And if uh, not too much light is inhibiting that, which I think there is, but uh, you can clearly see the green tint of the water coming out of the pipe. So this water is definitely really, really thick with plankton algae. And uh, the reason I did this is because I want the carpet algae to start to grow on the side walls and the bottom of this pond. That's actually a very beneficial thing to have in your pond system for the fish to eat during the winter time. But more than that, it creates another housing area for beneficial bacteria. So currently the nitrite is zero parts per million. I'm registering maybe 0 0.20 with phosphates just to keep the green water going. We're at April 13th of 2015. I just started dosing with new algae today, so it received three and a half milliliters. <laughs> What I'll do over the next several weeks is continue to dose with new algae, but I'm going to keep the green water going. And what I expect to do here is add some other natural ingredients to the pond water in about three or four weeks. And we'll register what's happening periodically. Once a week I'll come out here and take video to see where the water is. And I suspect that May 15th, we'll begin to have a very clear pond. Hey there folks, it's Christian and we are looking at the 3500 gallon pond here that we added spirulina to to make it green. Today is April 20th, 2015. We're a week into a new algae dose which we put in on the 13th of the month. As you can see the water is still very green, but note a distinct foaming, which is very green. 